The Houthi militia is still carrying out many crimes ranging from looting of land and property to raids on homes, companies and residential villages. In ties, a Houthi competition has recently emerged over the plundering of lands east of the city. This report has more. The leaders of the Houthi coup are dismantling a Thais-based wing of its own. The demolition of a school in the vicinity of Thais airport revealed a regional power struggle in which wings compete for influence, land, and public and private real estate. Last week, bulldozers pulled up to al Ta'aziyah district, in which Thais airport is located, to demolish a school that was built four years ago and level it to the ground claiming that it is located inside the campus of Thais Airport. Bulldozers were escorted by Houthi military vehicles in anticipation of civil opposition. According to sources, this move is a part of the Houthi leaders' attempts in Thais to regain control over the public and private properties that were taken by Salah Bajesh, a leader and Shura council member who impersonated the governor of Thais until last April. The sources indicated that the school was established four years ago in the name of Abd al-Rahman Bajesh, who died 10 years ago, and is one of the dignitaries of the region and father of the Houthi leader Salah Bajesh. The establishment of the school came as a ploy by his son Salah when he was still impersonating the governor of the province. Bajash used the school and the name of his father, who has a high profile in the local community, to win the support of the people of the area and to justify the land grab. Last April, Bajash was removed from his post as governor of Taiz and assigned to the militia Shura Council, thereby stripping him of the authority he had gained over the years. According to the sources, Bajash's failure to incite regionalism among people after the school demolition was due to his involvement in dubious business dealings, land robbery, and hunting out coup opponents. 